Hey, it's Kip with Rocky Mountain Bikes. In this video, we'll show you how to replace the drive cog on our Dynamae 4.0 power plates. The tools needed to do this are two and a half millimeter Allen key, three millimeter Allen key, four millimeter Allen key, a 10 millimeter Allen key, a chain whip or cassette pliers, torque wrench with a 10 millimeter Allen bit, and some grease and blue Loctite. For removing the drive cog, you'll first want to ensure that the bike is turned off. For extra safety measures, use your four millimeter Allen key to remove the battery plate and unplug the motor from the battery. With your three millimeter Allen key, please remove the drive side cover plate of the motor. With your two and a half millimeter Allen key, you can now remove the upper chain guide covering the drive cog. With your chain whip or cassette pliers, wrap it around the drive cog. And with your 10 millimeter Allen key, you can unscrew the lock ring for the drive cog. You can now remove the drive cog. For installation, clean the lock ring and the drive cog mount. Apply a small amount of grease to the new drive cog. Next, you can install the new drive cog. With the new drive cog installed, you can apply a little bit of blue Loctite to the lock ring for the drive cog. Place the lock ring onto the drive cog, threading it by hand. With your cassette pliers and torque wrench with a 10 millimeter Allen bit, you can now torque the lock ring for the drive cog to 40 Newton meters. Position the chain on the drive cog, torque arm, and cranks correctly. Reinstall the upper chain guide, making sure to have the derailleur housing in place correctly. You can now tighten down the upper chain guide with your two and a half mil Allen key. With your three millimeter Allen key, you can reinstall the drive side cover plate for the motor. Replug the motor cord to the battery and reinstall the battery cover plate with your four millimeter Allen key. 